You promised me to tell if there's anything haunting you. You leave without saying where you're going or where to. Should I worry that you won't come back? Should I worry that you will forget? My sense is telling me I shouldn't worry and know the truth. Ooh, yeah. We're just at home just now, as you can see, still in pyjamas. Ella was in my bed last night because you had a little bad dream, didn't you? What did you dream about? I dream about Nana with no eyes. You had a dream Nana had no eyes and then you woke up and there were shadows in your room and you said you thought the shadow was a monster. We soul. So what did you do? I come to your bed. And were you cuddling me? You you rascal? <laughs> I, I wasn't cuddling you. You weren't? Why? Why were you not cuddling me? I will. Ah, uh, you were. Are <laughs> you even going to get your hug? Hug you? Yeah, I did. That's the water in. Oh, was it? Mm. Nice water. Today we're just going to spend our morning in the house. I've got a little bit of filming to do for YouTube and tidying up and packing and stuff. So I'm just going to kind of show you a normal day in the life. And then later Ella's going to nursery. And I... Oh, do this. Close your ears. Both hands. Squeeze, ha squeeze hard. Uh. Squeeze hard. Uh. And when she's in nursery. Uh. Close your ears. I'll tell you later, it's not fair. I'm doing something after. And then later, you can undo it, it's okay. Put your hands down now. It's alright. Um, yeah, so after when I pick Ella up from nursery, she's going to her very first tumble class tonight. Sure you are. Mm -hmm. Are you excited about that? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> it's so funny when I take Ella to nursery. She just loves going, she's so ready for it. And like, you know what it's like, there's always a few kids that are just maybe a bit nervous and don't like leaving their mums and stuff. Um, but Charlie goes in and he loves it. And then obviously I get Ella ready and put her shoes on and stuff. And then when I go to leave, he has an absolute fit because he wants to stay. I feel like saying, swap around and you can just have Charlie and one of the other kids can go home. <laughs> because he really needs something, like he needs to go to our today. So I think, hi. Look. Oh, you don't, you don't stand up in that, just be careful. Yeah, I think he really needs something where he's like with other kids and stuff. So I'm going to try and see if what I can get him registered for a morning in a nursery a week. Yeah? What? It's a spider! <laughs> You're crazy, kiddo. Yeah, so I really need him to be like out the house like at least one morning a week maybe in like a private nursery or something Ella used to go to a playgroup which was amazing it was like eight pounds for two hours oh thanks this all the stuff that Charlie's emptying out the drawers yeah Ella used to go to playgroup twice a week for two hours in the morning it was like eight pounds a class or six pounds a class I'm not quite sure and um, it was just so good because it was time that she got to spend with other kids and Charlie doesn't have anything like that and I just feel he really needs it before He's three, like it feels like a long time to wait a year and a half until he can like do that kind of thing. So yes, I am like on the lookout for 
a nursery or a playgroup that will just do a morning because the thing that Ella went to is closed now so anyway Charlie and I have had breakfast but this one hasn't so we're going to go downstairs I need to get ready I did all my like showering and pampering and moisturising and face stuff last night so um, I just need to get a quick shower this morning and get ready and then we will go on with our day do my darling son are going to go for a nap before Ella goes to nursery today because we are doing stuff this afternoon, sure we are. Look at him just emptying the drawers. What did you say? Crazy mummy. <laughs> hmm? I was looking for you. I was looking after for your baby called Annabelle and your, and your baby's little hat. Is that our hat? Mm -hmm. What's that lid from? That's Red boy, the hmm, guess. I don't know. <laughs> um, the hairdryer. No. The hairspray. Yeah. So Charlie's just going for a nap, and me and Ella are just sitting playing with her little babies, aren't we? Mm. I'm all ready for the day now, but I'm going to be going out after I drop Ella. With my friend, so um. Mom, that's the baby pool. As I said, and we're in the baby pool just now, which is a blanket on the floor, which is a pool, isn't it? Mm -hmm. We're just pretending. <gasps> you have got an animal in the pool. That's a monster animal. Run away out. Ah, run. <laughs> it, it's just a dog. <laughs> So at the moment I've been like putting my hair up in a bun because I just think it's so much mommy, easier and Ella wanted the same for you then. Mum, you're for, you're for far away too. Have I run far away? You're far, you're, that, that's what I love and that's what you love far away. Okay. Do you like your hair? Mm-hmm. What is it the same as? Yeah. <laughs> it's the it's same as your food. It's the, it's the same as the, it's the same as your friend. Who's my friend? You. Me? Oh, it's the same as your friend? Are you calling me friend? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's so nice. Thank you, friend. You're very kind. Would you like to have a picnic on this floor? Sandwich and raspberries? Um, yeah! Let me get it sorted then, okay? Yeah, okay, friend. Okay, friend. <laughs> so here's Ella's little lunch today. She's having a chicken and mayo wrap with a whole bunch of raspberries. Well, and then I'm these little... Friend, oh, sorry, you're my friend. Sorry, my friend Ella is having a chicken mayo wrap, raspberries, and then these little bars, which are from Aldi. Here you go, friend. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Can I open them? No, oh, you can open that once you've eaten your wrap, okay? And your stro and your raspberries. Not strawberries, the raspberries. <laughs> oh. That's the one. Oh. Wakey wakey, Charlie Reed. Hey? Did a nice sleep? We got Charlie these little trainers and honestly, they are the worst things to get on because these laces are just like elasticated. Oh, sorry, darling. But they're a nightmare getting on. Sure they are. Nightmare. Yay! Hey? What are you saying, crazy girl? Right, socks and shoes and it's time for nursery. Woo! Mummy's just going to do the dishes, right? You sit up there next to me. Because we don't like leaving dishes before we go out, sure we don't? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Mummy, Can you guys hear him saying that? He goes, Mummy, and then he starts to tell me something. That's because Ella does that, doesn't she? What does Ella say? Does Ella say, Mummy? Are you a wee piggy? Mm -hmm. Masella. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right, I'm going to have to lift you down with wet hands. <laughs> Does it? Mm -hmm. So what colour are they? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nude. Nude, that's right, put in. Nude. Did you put your socks on yourself? Um, yeah. You're very good at doing that. 
good You actually know how to put your shoes on yourself, don't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Can I do it by myself, please? Yeah, let me fix this wee sock up for you. Okay. Right, put it in. Let's I show. Can, I can do this by myself. Right, in the wee buckle. That's it. Pull it back. That's it, almost. almost. Oh, it's not through the wee hole yet, remember? That's it. Pull and then through the back bit. It goes like that. That's it, big girl. Take your time. Oh, amazing! Well done! Good job. Hey, you going to play with Alexis? Hey, where's Alexis? Where is she? Watch this, look. Charlie, who's that? Charlie. Charlie, look. Charlie, who's that? Say Alexis. Come on. Say Alexis. Baby. Baby. Oh, what's that? No. She's like a wee babe. Oh, cuddle. Oh, cuddle. Oh, cuddle. That's so cute. Give Alexis a kiss. Give her a kiss. Mm. Give her a kiss. Ma. Oh, good boy. A kiss. Look, there's your face. Look. There's your face. Give her a kiss. Alexis, you can have your Give her a kiss. <laughs> He's like, look, there's your dummy, Alexis. Tom. Oh, they love each other. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you guys are so cute. Oh, Charlie, she sure loves him. Look. Oh, Kado, that's right. Oh, guys, seem like get married and like. 25 years time. We're going to reflect back in this moment. <laughs> so I've just picked up nursery girl. Should I have? And all of these boxes from mom's work. So these are going to serve for good packing. And obviously me and Charlie went to see Melise and Alexis. And now we're going to take Ella to tumble class. So yeah, very excited. Charlie's not happy about that. He was on my shoulders and he's pulled all my hair out. So <laughs> angry boy, upset girl. What can you do? So this is our kind of Friday night, um, just the kids and I. Ella, mm -hmm. how was tumble class? Good. Did you love it? Mm -hmm. What were you doing? Bernie? Back holy polies. Back with holy polies? There you go, ah, uh, McDonald's, a wee treat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because mum's so unorganised with this move and we've not got any food in. So on the other hand, have been a little monster. Charlie, what have you been saying all day? Angry. No, what have you been saying all day to mummy? You've been saying... No. No. Yep, not good. No. Yep, all day long. So Ella was amazing, like really, really good. Like quite easy to like transition from nursery, get her changed into her class. So well behaved. Charlie, on the other hand, Oh my god, he was a nightmare, he just ran back and forward the whole time and I just had to like run about after him and then after about half an hour I thought I'll just bring him back into the car for 15 minutes until it finishes and then I obviously went to wait on Ella and he scratched my face. Like full on grabbed both sides of my face and just scratched it. He's definitely going through a phase just now and yeah, I just don't know what to do with them. I don't remember this with Ella. She might have done it, but I don't remember her being so, like, headstrong and aggressive. Like, he's actually been aggressive. So I'm hoping this is just, like, a stage thing because it's so upsetting when he's just not behaving. But, um, yeah, hopefully it's, like, a frustration thing and when he can talk properly, it goes away, I hope. But anyway, we're having a drive through dinner tonight because Fraser's still at work and I'm just going to treat the kids to a little McDonald's on a Friday because if you can't do it tonight then when are you going to do it? <laughs>